I'm Sal. I'm Beth. The Brewery Lovers. We are at Crime and Punishment in Brewery Town. Brewery Town, to tell you the history, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, by the way. Brewery Town was where most of the breweries were at the turn of the century. The turn of the lead, like that. Before Prohibition. Yeah. And, of course, most of them went out of business in Prohibition, like every other brewery in, in uh, the United States, most of them. But there's a few left. There's a few new ones. Crime and Punishment is among them. Not too new, only six years old, Six right? years. Beer is seriously banging. I'm like, seriously banging. So we had an electronic hazy. Yep. You had a space race. Yep. Outside VA. Yep. This is Boston, which is a double IPA. I haven't even tried it yet. And that's the I'm having beer. the Schwartz beer the, with notes of dark chocolate and Philly pretzel. Philly pretzel. <laughs> What's it called? Remember? I don't know. I don't know. All right, we're gonna try the double IPA. They named the brewery after the Dostoevsky novel. Yes, which is why there's a lot of. It's very Eastern European stuff here. Teams and the beer names and stuff. It's got a huge, hugely dank uh, nose. It's really good. Not a hint of sweetness. Super smooth, super dry. And it's, it doesn't taste like high alcohol either, so that's one you could definitely do damage to yourself with. It's very, very smooth. And the pale ale was awesome too. So, yeah, the pale ale had. Rwaka. Rwaka. New Zealand. She looked, took one look at it and she said, that's from New Zealand. She was right. <laughs> She's like the hop whisperer. <laughs> anyway, short form, we came here, didn't really expect to. It's kind of uh, a little bit off the beaten track, but cool neighborhood, cool brewery. And uh, check it out if you're in Philly. Good? Yeah, good. Cheers.